Hey, it's Brooke Taylor from Hot 107.9 and Selena Gomez performing here tonight at Bankers Life Fieldhouse. And we're going to go backstage, sit down with Selena in her dressing room to ask her a couple questions. All right, so first what we like to do in our um, our interviews is um, our station's Hot 107.9, so we like to kind of like put you in what we call the hot seat. So okay. it's just real like quick fire questions. It's okay. really easy. So we'll okay. start you off easier since you're a little sleepy. <laughs> this will get you warmed up a little bit. Okay. All right, iPhone or Android? iPhone. Yes. Starbucks or Dunkin' Donuts? Starbucks. Yeah, It's maybe. traditional, but I just, Dunkin' Donuts, it's more options for food. True. That's what I like. True. Um, dogs or cats? Dogs. Uh, summer or winter? Uh, uh, summer. <laughs> <laughs> Favorite song to sing in the shower? Uh, Shania Twain. So. Yes, Shania Twain. Awesome. I love her. Um, the last song you listened to on your iPod? We just listened to Christina Aguilera's album. Like, what was it called? Like, stripped. Stripped. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's such good a good record. one. Yes, awesome. All right, and um, our followers, we call them our hotties, and they asked us a couple questions on Twitter to okay. ask you. At Demi AK Perfect says, do you like Nutella? Uh, of course. <laughs> I uh, don't know if I would be a proper female if I didn't. So Amen to absolutely. that. <laughs> At Aaliyah Michaela wants to know what is your favorite sport? Um, to watch basketball. Mm -hmm. To play, I don't play any, so I guess I should have said that. <laughs> That's a bit. Bad. But to watch, yes, basketball. Awesome. At the story tease says, who is your girl crush? Oh, I have so many. It's a hard decision. I do. <laughs> I I do have so many. I like, I love my, my dancer, Charity. Mm -hmm. She's definitely one of them. Perfect. I just think she's super uh, cute. Mm -hmm. And then um, I'm friends with the surfer girl who's beautiful in every way. And yeah. just a total tomboy. And I got I got a crush on her. I mean, it's <laughs> we all have our girl crushes. We you have know our how girl crushes. At Athena Hoover wants to know who is your biggest inspiration? Um, honestly, without it, sounding you know, cheesy I, it's my fans because mm -hmm. every time I get off stage I have this you when you see these kids watching mm -hmm. you and they're listening to every word you're saying it means so much mm -hmm. that I get off stage wanting to talk about life so literally <laughs> I feel so bad that when I, as soon as I get off I'm running around and I'm yeah. talking about everything about goals and mm -hmm. about what I want to do to inspire these kids so I'd have to say fans yeah for sure You've been super busy releasing your fourth album, Star Stance, on your first VMA. Yeah. Was that the most amazing thing ever? It was. Just because I didn't I didn't expect it. Mm -hmm. I really didn't. Yeah. Just because it was my first time and I had gone so many times yeah. that my speech was so I said take care at the end of my <laughs> speech. Like who says that? I was so <laughs> I was so shocked that mm -hmm. I didn't. I really didn't prepare because I genuinely. And didn't that's almost prepared. better that you didn't. Yeah. So you know those people who pull out the like, take care. <laughs> they pull out the speeches out of their pocket. Yeah. And they're like, I'd like to thank this, this, uh, and this. I know. I, I like the more genuine kind of, you know, reaction <laughs> yeah. from you. That's awesome. Thanks. You and Taylor Swift. Do you guys like plan sitting next to each other, or mm -hmm. do they sit well, next to each other? Well, not anymore. But mm -hmm. at first, because we've been friends forever. And yeah. I I love. I, I need her to get through those things. Yeah. The text. It's so hard. <laughs> yeah. Sometimes. Mm -hmm. And then um, we started calling everybody, telling them we wanted to be seated together. Now they don't even call. They just put us together. That's awesome. So now people know that we That's just like to sit together. Super, super cool. Yeah. All right. Um, and speaking of your tour, um, has it just been crazy for you? Are you having the best time? I or? am. Yeah. I think this has been the best thing that I've done. Uh, the best tour I've done. Mm -hmm. And just for myself, it's been great to be on yeah. my own and figure out everything and run it by myself it's been good yeah that's awesome um and this is i was just always curious about this do you, are, do you have any say in your opening acts or are they just kind of like yeah um <clears throat> yeah of course but <clears throat> we 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 obviously let um, people come and give us stuff yeah absolutely and, yeah. and then you just kind of yeah, help make take. that decision yeah. cool all right your first number one single come and get it mm. i saw the video of your reaction for it oh, was that <laughs> it's like five in the morning in new york and i'm like <laughs> Like, what's going on right now? But describe how that felt. Was it? It, it just to, because it took four records mm -hmm. to get, it means so much more to me. Just because I've had, you know, I've had really great songs, mm -hmm. but to have that, you know, that's an, that's an undeniable feeling. So Absolutely. It was, a, it was a good moment. Cool. All right, so next week you're performing the National Anthem at the Cowboys game. No, I'm doing halftime show. Oh, halftime show? Who said National Anthem earlier? I don't know, but I'm giving you six minutes instead of yes. like a video. Oh, so exciting. Okay, so you're you're performing at halftime, yeah. and you're going to be home, right, yes. basically? Yes. Is that 
is that like the first time you've ever I'm, kind of been in that I'm, position? No, I'm actually, it is, but I'm actually nervous because I'd always watch it. So oh, yeah. as opposed to me being on my couch, like completely stuffing my food in my <laughs> face with food, yeah. I'm going to now be there. Yeah. Um, so I'm a little nervous, yeah. but it's going to be really good. We've been rehearsing every day for it and Perfect. the dance is going to be really great. I'm yes. Excited. Can't wait for it. Um, so are you going to be able to like sit down with your family, have a meal, that yeah, kind of Yeah, we're actually, we're going to stay there and watch the game as a family, mm -hmm. but I'm having my Nana cook the food and put it in the Tupperware and bring it to the game Smart. so that I could eat it after Smart. I'm done. Smart. Smart. Okay, so let's paint this picture really quick. You're at the dinner table, your family, all of your friends, yes. all of your loved ones are there. It's your turn to answer the question, what are you thankful for this year? My little sister. Yeah. Your baby baby sister. Yes. She's five months and she's everything to me. That's awesome. Um, North America tour ends next week. Yeah. Right? Are you That's so are you weird. Bummed? Oh, I didn't want to bring up a sore subject. It's okay. <laughs> it's okay. I, I it's been really good. And we're we extended it, so we're yeah. actually we're gonna head out to Asia and Australia. Yeah, I was gonna say you're going overseas in the yeah. beginning of next year. And then what's next after that? What can we expect from you? I'm gonna go I'm gonna go back into movies. So Great. I'm just gonna go back into that world mm -hmm. and get inspired and then probably start working on movies. Awesome. Well, thank you so much for sitting down with us today, and we can't wait for your show tonight. Thank you. You're welcome.